When working with Laravel API and Vue.js projects, what if you need the list of something, list of records, both paginated and non-paginated? So look at the screen. There is a list of categories paginated by five per page. In total, there are 50 categories and you can paginate that. And every API call to the endpoint lists only one page you need. So only five records. But in another page in posts list, you need to filter posts by categories. And here you need the full list of categories. So you need 50 records here, not only five. So how can you use the same API endpoint for both paginated and non-paginated case? Or should it be the same API endpoint? Maybe there should be a separate one. Let's take a look at the possibilities. In the code, we have category index view component, which gets the result with page. So that API categories endpoint is on the backend in category controller, which returns category paginate by five. And in the posts list, we have that drop down four categories and on mounted, we still get those categories trying to do that without page. But by default, it still returns five records, not all 50. So what can we do here? First, and probably the easiest, is to create a separate endpoint. So in the routes API on the backend, you get categories list. You create a separate method list with category all doing the same thing. And then in the post index, we just change that to categories list. We save and PM run watch rebuilds the whole thing in JavaScript and we refresh the page for the posts. And then we have 50 categories as we want it and categories is still paginated. So the most straightforward way is to create a separate API endpoint for the list and for the paginated list. But what if you want to combine them in one endpoint and want to do it all in index in this method? Then let's add a parameter. So request, let's add a request and then we return same collection, but from different query. So categories equals category paginate, but depending on the request. So request input, for example, all and by default empty equals one. Then we return all. So category all. Otherwise it's paginated. Let's reformat it a little. You guys are asking me to make the font bigger often, but then the downside is it doesn't fit on the screen often. So there is a condition, all parameter, if it equals one, the get parameter, then we return all, otherwise we paginate. And then we put those categories as a parameter for that collection. And then on the front end, we may change from categories list back to categories with all equals one. We save, build successful, we refresh the page, and we have our categories still paginated and pagination works, but let's take a look at posts list. It still has all the 50 categories. So another way of doing that is to leave the same endpoint, but introduce some parameter by which you decide whether it's all records or paginated, or we can make it even more flexible. And instead of that, we can make paginated records dynamic. So we don't ever return category all, but the amount of records per page would be dynamic. So for example, per page and default would be five. So these are the categories. And then in the categories, we may define a different pagination. So for example, per page equals 10 and page something. So we can save that one. And then in the post index, instead of all one, we just do per page some big number. For example, for example 1000. So if you know that the amount of records won't be more than something, you can do that. Let's refresh. Same result, 50 categories here and categories now paginated by 10. Let's click around, pagination still works. So that is even more flexible probably, but then please be aware that you need to validate that per page. So you can do something like request, validate, and then the set of rules. So the set of rules would be array and then per page, for example, numeric, minimum one, maximum 1000, for example. So someone wouldn't hack and try to put bigger numbers or letters or something like that. And final note, getting back to the separate endpoint, so categories list, it does make sense if the structure is different. So for example, for categories list, you need all the fields and you have like 20 fields, for example, in the database, 20 columns. 
And for categories list, you only need ID and the name, for example. So then it does make sense to separate those as a separate endpoints because they are separate in a structure way. But otherwise, if you need just paginated or non-paginated but with the same or similar structure, these are the ways that I've shown. And that demo project, by the way, is taken from my online course about Vue, SPA and Laravel API. So the link will be on the screen. You can enroll in that if you want to learn how to create Vue.js table with all the pagination, all the title and sorting and new form and all of that. So if you know how to do that in Laravel, but want to do that in Vue SPA, this is the course for you. Meanwhile, I will continue shooting free videos on YouTube with random Laravel tips. So subscribe to the channel and see you guys in other videos.